Hello friends, I welcome you to a new day. Jesus is Lord and his Lordship is forever. Can we just go ahead and appreciate him? It's entirely a new day. Somebody help me glorify him. Give him glory. Give him praise. Give him worship. Thank him for the access we have to where he dwells. He's God all by himself. There is none to be compared with him. He's the one that walk upon the sea. When he speaks, there is multitude of waters in the heavens. He spared their life in a new day to glorify him. Thanksgiving is the past what to approach the throne room this morning somebody go in thanksgiving our redeemer we hail you our hiding place in the time of trouble our help we give you glory we give you praise your government is forever we are internally grateful to you we worship you we celebrate you we join the 20 and the four elders to give you the glory, to give you the praise. We joined all the protocols in the throne room, including the four beasts, to bow and to reverence you and to say, Father, you are mighty. You are the mighty healer. You are the ocean divider. You are the obstacle crusher. Barrier breaker is your name. We give you glory, my Father. We give you praise. Somebody go ahead and appreciate him. I said thanks giving is the password. Use the password to where he dwells this morning. We worship you. We glorify you. Sweet Holy Spirit, we welcome you into a new day. And we want to declare that we love you. Your dominion is forever. Blessed be the name of the Lord. For we worship with thanksgiving in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And amen. Now, let's do this song together as we proceed in God's presence this morning. What a glorious morning. That's the voice of prayer on the global airwaves. And it is contagious. Let's do this song together, friends, as we proceed. Mm. My God is able. He's able. I know he is able. I know my God is able to carry me through. Yes, my God is able. He's able. I know God is able. I know my God is able to carry me through. For he has healed the broken hearted, set the captives free, healed the sick, raise the dead and walk upon the sea. My God is able, he's able, I know he's able. I know my God is able to carry me through. Yes, my God is able. He's able. I know God is able. I know my God is able to carry me through. Yes, my God is able. He's able. I know he's able. I know my God is able to carry me through. For he has healed the broken hearted. Set the captives free, heal the sick, raise the dead, and walk upon the sea. My God is able, he's able, I know he's able, 
I know my God is able to carry me through. I don't know about you. Now join me. My God is able. He's able. Yes, I know he's able. I know my God is able to carry me through. Sing it as you mean it. My God is able. He's able. Ha. I know he's able. I know my God is able to carry me through. For he has you, the broken hearted, ha. said the captive is free. Heal the sick, raise the dead, and walk upon the sea. My God is able, he's able. I know he is able. Ha. I know my God is able to carry me through. I know that God is able to carry you through. Yes, I know. My God is able to carry me through. Shania kagada bagado shantere gede de la gado la gede de la gado begedo shantere gede de la gado the mantle of prayer is already on the global prayer line zikete pele gedo take yours makian de 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 la gado shabragado this is spirit praise daily devotional and spirit praise daily devotional comes your way every morning to build up your spiritual capacity and network it comes as a daily dose to strengthen your spiritual cables and wires and to keep you ablaze for God all day. And our topic this morning says godliness makes the difference. Briefly this morning we take our Bible reading from 1 Timothy 4 verse 8b. I read from the King James Version and also the New Living Translations. But godliness is profitable unto all things, having promise of the life that now is and of that which is to come. The New Living Translations. The training for godliness is much better, promising benefits in this life and in the life to come. <laughs> Permit me to start by saying that the call to be a Christian is the call to the life of godliness. Listen to me, friends. Godliness makes all the difference for now and eternity. That's why our text this morning says, promising benefits in this life and in the life to come. That means to live a godly life goes with internal benefits. As a matter of fact, some believers today, their life is under contention between evil and good. Contention between doing the right thing and doing the wrong. Contention between godliness and worldliness. But friend, hear me. The truth is that godliness pays off in all things. Godliness pays off in all things. And someone is asking, Barrister Joy, what does godliness mean? Simply put, godliness has to do with living for God, becoming like Jesus. It's all about godly lifestyle. And our text this morning is saying, godliness is profitable. It is profitable in the sense that God made an investment in us as believers by sending his only begotten son, Jesus, to die in our place. And God's desire is to realize some returns. God's desire is to realize some profits on his investment. And my prayer for someone on the line this morning is that you will not allow God's investment in your life to be a waste. I said you will not allow his investment in your life to be a waste. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. A man like Apostle Paul understood the heaviness of the investment that God made concerning his life when he said in Philippians 1 verse 21, for to me to live is Christ and to die is gain. That was Apostle Paul for you, a man apprehended for the kingdom. 
now just before we pray if you look at the a aspect of our text the bible recorded that bodily exercise profited a little which is to say there is some level of profit in bodily exercise but hear me friends the level of profit for bodily exercise is programmed for this life it does not exceed this life but godliness or right standing with god is profitable i said it's profitable not just for the duration of your life here on earth but in eternity hear me friends in this season godliness has become an essential commodity for every christian so the call to every listener to this broadcast is to make godliness a priority and that's why the bible says in matthew 6 verse 33 but seek ye first the kingdom of god and his righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you hear me friends Whatever you cannot find in God is not worth searching for. You can quote me. Ziketepe legedede legadoche. And hear me from 1 Timothy 4 verse 8. The reason why godliness is more important and much more better than bodily exercise is because of its internal value. Physical fitness is only profitable while you still have this physical body. Hear me. It has no business with eternity. But the good news is that godliness is profitable for all things. Mark the word for all things. Then for none and for eternity. Friends, hear me. Only a fool can say there is no God. So I came to challenge us as we pray to make godliness your priority and begin to enjoy all the dividends and profits that goes with it for now and eternity. In the matchless name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Let us pray. Now, just before we pray, the Lord is leading me to pray for someone on the line. You have been a Christian for quite some time now, but you have no business with godliness. Please quickly lay your right hand on your chest and say after me, My Father in heaven, I come to you today. Please forgive me. Give me the power and the grace to live a godly lifestyle. Help me to jettison worldliness and to serve you with my whole heart. Thank you, my Father. You will make returns from my life henceforth. Say it as you mean it. You will make returns from my life henceforth. You will make profit from my life henceforth. This is my prayer and my desire. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for hearing me and for answering me. Thank you for forgiving me. In Jesus Christ's mighty name we prayed. Amen and amen. And I decree and declare that this decision you have taken today shall forever remain permanent. You will love godliness. You will live a godly lifestyle. And God will make profit over your life from today. In the matchless name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Since let's go. Kalia kagadaba legedede lagados, malian de regedede lagados, sike legede lagados, shanta regedede lagados. Receive fresh capacity for godly lifestyle. Zekete pe legedede lagados, zene kanana mos endra kalagadabo, sike legedede lagados. Our text says godliness is profitable for now and eternity. Zene kanana mos endra kalagadaba legedede lagados, zekete pe legedos, malia kagadaba legedede lagados, zekete legedos, bra legedede legedos, zekete pe legedos. Malian de 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 zekete pelegedo. He that prayeth in tongues, I say, listen. He that prayeth in tongues, edifieth himself. Can you edify yourself in the tongues of the angels? Ekelegedo. Malian de 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 zekete pelegedo. Godliness is profitable. Edify yourself. Zekete pelegedo in the tongues of the angels. For the Bible says in Jude 20, he that prayeth in tongues, edifieth himself. Zekete pelegedo. Zekete de pelegedo. Zinekenenenemos. Indra. Receive grace to be like Jesus. Go in the Holy Ghost. Zinekelanamos. Indra Kalagada Balegede Lagadu. Rekete Pelegedo. Rekete Pelegedo. Zenekananamos. Indra Kalagada Bush. Zegede Delegedo. Edify yourself. Zikete Pelegedo. Rekete Pelegedo. Regede Delegedo. Bralegedos in Delegede Lagadu. Maleke Lego. Zigelegede Balagado. Malia Kagada Balegede Delegedo. Zinekananamos. Indra Kalagada Bush. Zekete Pelegedo. Bralege Delegedo. Brekete Pelegedo. Malia Kagada Balegede Delegado. Shanta. Ha, Jesus, 
we give you all that glory <laughs> thank you for the mantle of godliness that is being distributed on this altar this morning <laughs> there is a global distribution of the mantle of godliness on this global altar this morning take yours father we say thank you we give you all that glory we give you all that praise we magnify you the king in glory thank you for hearing our prayers and reign forever the king that never dies and i decree and declare to everyone who has listened to this broadcast that grace for godliness shall be released upon you and you shall enjoy the benefits now and forevermore in the mighty name of jesus christ amen father we give you thanks reign forever our father we love you and we bless you and blessed be the name of the king in zion for we prayed with thanksgiving and we know it is done in jesus christ matchless name we prayed amen kale kale zuna kanamas ikra katapa legedos go rule your day in partnership with the holy spirit with the holy spirit with the holy spirit